to my channel today's video is so exciting because this video is my what's in my theme part bag I am in Florida right now and when you're watching this I am at Universal I'm so excited so I do have a few bags um, so this was really hard to decide what I wanted to bring I do have my yellow one my mini backpack that I got in 2020 for Florida and I really love that backpack um, but I saw something so much cuter so I have a new backpack but that yellow one the foul raven I think that's how you call it it's really great so my little sister Amy is going to be using that until we find her a bag at Disney but this is going to be my main bag throughout Universal and all of the Disney theme parks and I'm so excited so everything is just a huge jumbled mess right now because I'm trying to pack and be very prepared um even though it's not like a stressful thing it kind of is I don't know this is my bag and I love it so much I got it from Hot Topic I think it was $50 which is really price it priced really good for these backpacks and yeah I love it it's a Harry Potter lounge fly backpack and this is the Weasley Brothers Fred and George in their little shop and their little logo and it has like all the little tricks and treats and everything they do throughout the movies and I love it so much I just love that they have their little store logo right here I only have two flaws about this backpack one so there are two zippers so you can zip it um anyway but I just figured out that the bottom zipper that I have does not close the bag. So this is broke, I guess. Maybe I can fix it. Um, so that's pretty sad. But the top zips shut, so we're good with that. Um, the second thing that I don't like, this is my <laughs> thing. I don't really like the color purple. So this being majorly all purple is kind of freaky to me. <laughs> but it's okay. I will suffer for the cute backpack. Okay, so the first thing are the pocket. They do have side pockets, which is really nice, and they're very small, so I'm pretty sure I can fit, like, my mask or, like, some hand sanitizer wipes, and they won't fall out. First, I have hand sanitizer. I... You guys know, you need hand sanitizer, especially at the theme parks. The one at Universal smells so bad it makes me gag. <laughs> like, almost throw up. I need my own hand sanitizer, and... I just love this one. This one is from Walgreens. I have one from Target that I like also, but they're both the pumps, which is really nice. So I'm going to fill this up. Even though it's already filled up, I'm going to fill it up even more before we leave. So this puck is empty. Then in the main compartment, I have a mask. I do need to clean this right before we leave. I have my vaccination card that I'm going to show them so that I don't have to wear a mask, but I brought a mask just in case, even though I'm probably going to buy a Hufflepuff mask. There's that. Also, I have a pair of wired headphones because I will need that for the car ride um, or if my sister needs it because I will be using my wireless headphones. So that is all that's in this front compartment. Not much. I do want to get a pack of gum so I will be. Let's pretend there's a pack of gum in there as well. Let's also pretend there's ibuprofen in there because I will need it for my back because my back hurts so bad after walking in the theme parks all day long. So let's pretend it has those two things in there. Okay so for the main compartment it's literally a jumbled mess like gosh and there's so much room so i'm pretty happy because i will be able to fit my butterbeer souvenir cup and some other souvenirs in this backpack the first thing is obviously your wallet i would suggest having something very small like this to carry your cash your card whatever yeah it's pretty simple my little emergency bag and this is just has my little sunscreen this is the super goop unseen sunscreen i've been wearing this a lot like the last few weeks that i bought it and i really like it so i think i'm going to keep this in this backpack for the whole time and then i just have five ponytails hair ties whatever you guys call it i call it ponytails that's just I've always called it. I have five of them because I have I am a chaperone for four girls and I just want to make sure I have one for each person. So that's basically what's in there. Sunscreen and ponytails. Love that. So then I have my uh, glasses. I don't think I will need them in the theme parks but we are leaving late at night so I do have them in here for now. I do have a fragrance spray. This is the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Crush Body Spray. I love this so much. It's just the bum bum cream. Mmm. And the body spray, it smells so good. 
and I just have that because you you need some kind of spray especially in a theme park it's about to be very crowded this day that i'm here it will be very crowded i'm going the day before st patty's day and like express passes are sold out i'm so upset that i didn't pick them up um so it's gonna be very crowded so i do have spray to spray myself and around me next i have hand lotion i always need hand lotion my hands are super dry we're gonna be in florida so you really do need some lotion of any kind this is the Gold Bond Ultimate Diabetes Hand Cream. This works really well for my skin. Um, it's very creamy and does not leave your hands too greasy. So next, I'm so excited, is a phone charger battery pack. I just charged it up so it is full, fully charged and ready to charge phones. This charges three phones charges a phone three times i really, really wish they had black but they only had blue left so it is what it is and i'm really excited to use this my phone tends to die so quickly every day anyway so so i'm excited to have one of these to save my life because i did have my phone die on me like every time i go to universal so next is a another sunscreen this is the neutrogena ultra sheer SPF 30. I really love this sunscreen and I'm going to keep this in here because this is really great for all over your body and your face. I will be retouching my sunscreen, um, especially on my shoulders and my neck and my cheeks. That's where I need it the most. So next I have a, a charger cube. A pen. You never know when you need a pen. I feel like you just need at least one pen in your, in your bag. And a lip gloss because I just girl needs some lip gloss sometimes so that's everything that's in this bag now i'm going to share with you guys a few tips that i will be carrying along with this i do not have any snacks but i will have snacks when i go home the day before and me and my sister are going to go buy some granola bars and gum and just some quick like packets of nuts something to keep us munching on stuff because i do get motion sickness <laughs> i've had it for a long time so i will need to do that so definitely have snacks you can bring snacks into the park you can bring like a whole lunch that's awesome besides some ibuprofen or advil or whatever for back pain i'm not going to bring like an extra pair of socks or clothing just because we're not going to go on any rides i don't like getting wet and then having to walk around for four hours to try to dry i just that's not my thing i'd rather sweat and wipe myself down also i will be getting makeup wipes or just like facial wipes to put in my bag so that's what else will be in the bag but other than that that's pretty much it my bag is very empty and ready to be filled with souvenirs i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to like and subscribe let me know if you've been to a theme park universal disney and what are some of your favorite things to pack in your mini backpack thank you guys for watching and i will see you in my next video bye